Good morning, friends. We are on our way outside. I got my rain boots, y'all. I'm thinking it was gonna be seat and the police out here. Y'all know what's going on in Cleveland. Shit, I'm sure it's happening anywhere, but it's a mess. My friends, yesterday, hold on, I'll tell y'all in the car. Ooh, clean car, he was for real. I know what y'all man say. He cleaned y'all car. And he do his version of cleaning, but it's clean. So, <sighs> it's some shit going on, y'all. I don't know what it is. It's actually quite scary. So I stay my behind in the house. I don't have time. I just don't. Can't really even see me. All right, this past Sunday, me and my dude was in the bed. And we live on the first floor. So there is a, um, I think that was the Browns game, the game that, I don't know, that was so exciting recently. I don't know, y'all. I don't know nothing about that. But, um, yeah, so we in the bed, you know, about to get ready to go to work Monday morning. And we hear some shots, but they weren't really shots because they were so small. Like, it was, I don't even know how to explain it. But it was like little pop, pop, pop. Not boom, boom, boom. But then again, I ain't never been in close vicinity of a gun shooting aside from the gun range. So I don't know what it's supposed to sound like. I don't know what different guns sound like, whatever. We thinking, and we seen the flash. Like, it was, it had to be somebody standing close to outside of our window. So I'm gonna try to. I need to just go ahead and order my little thingy for Amazon because I'm trying to talk to y'all. Oh, my head is a mess. <gasps> and I'm going to the grocery store like this. Oh my God. Oh, see, that's what being natural is. Like, yo, at least for my hair, it literally just like, it just doesn't do anything. Once it's dry, it needs to be washed. It don't, it just don't do it. But, um, yeah, so we heard them shots and we obviously hit the floor and, and shit. Like, what the fuck? That was Sunday. Yesterday, was it yesterday? My friend, she texted our group chat and there was a video of some snipers on top of somebody's garage in their backyard. Maybe, I would say, 10 minutes away from where I live. Um, she lives around here too and her cousin does, which is who sent it to her. And so, they laying on the damn garage with snipers. I don't know who they waiting on to come outside the dang on door. Ooh, this lightning is bad, but y'all gonna have to hear me. I don't know who they was waiting on, y'all, but they was waiting to get somebody. I haven't heard anything on the news. I've been trying to see what's up. Then I read a story on, I forget where it was. I think it was Facebook. It was somebody who reposted something. Basically, this woman took her daughter to a um, hotel party in Atlanta set her up her mama dropped her off at a hotel party her mom even said that she confirmed with the little girl's mom that she would be there so i'm thinking that the little girl was a hating ass little girl and sent the victim to the wrong hotel room because when her mom dropped her off and she went inside she's like mom no one's here yet and her mom was like i'll just give it time you know being encouraging because it's like well what Maybe you just early, or maybe they knew they was early. You know, you never know little details like that that actually matter. <sighs> but, see, look, the police sitting right there. But, um, yeah, so she ended up, the little girl was in the room. My 16-year-old little boy came in the room. Look at my head, child. 16-year-old little boy came in the room, tried to rape her, and because she fought back, he shot her in the vagina. In the freaking fucking vagina. Let her bleed out, and now she gone. Man, what? What? That is so crazy to me. It's just, ugh, ugh, it's so sick. It is so sick, and my anxiety cannot handle that. Even if it is in Atlanta, like anything can happen anywhere. God bless that that girl and her her, her family. Uh, and then today in Cleveland, another woman is searching for her daughter who disappeared from her aunt's house. It's just, oh, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on with this shit that happened 
that's happening with the Capitol and the shit that's happening everywhere. It's just too much. It's too much. And sometimes it's sad. You're not even safe at your family's house. You're not even safe at home. Where the hell are we safe? Like, ugh. And this grocery store is popping. Y'all, I'm sick with it. Mm -hmm. I may need to rethink my decision. Because I don't ever usually go this late. I never usually go this late, but we gonna see. We gonna see. What's up? But Audi is my favorite. I see somebody on, uh, look, in other related news and, oh, and lighter news, y'all. Seen somebody on Facebook say, do you say Audis or do you say Audi? It's called Audi, I'm looking at the sign. It's called Audi. But I say Audis, but it's like, okay. It's called Target, but do you say, oh, I'm about to go to Target's. Oh, it's called, oh, what days works. What's another store? Oh, I'm about to go to Walmart. Do you say Walmarts, plural? No, you don't, because that's retarded. But all these is just like, I've been saying this since I was a kid, but I'm gonna try. Oh, look at this skin! Look at this skin, y'all. Look at this skin, this is Herbal City. Get into it. But anyway, this is gonna be a weekend vlog. I said all of that to say this is gonna be a weekend vlog. And mostly I'm just chilling out. Y'all bought an Amazon wig, a headband wig, because at this point I don't feel like doing my hair. It's not at its healthiest. And if I'm choosing between doing my hair and mama hair, it's gonna be mama hair. Which means my hair is gonna look like this. It's all matter. I'm trying to keep it like contained, but I know once I hit outside and everything like that. It's just going to not be cute. But y'all, my skin, this is all, this is the Seamoss collection. Mm. It does wonders, it is doing wonders for me. This is my second time using it. I got a mask and stuff I'm gonna do later. I just need to get myself together. My nails ain't done, y'all should see my feet. See my hair. So it's gonna be like a self care weekend vlog. But of course, I can't be caring for myself if I ain't eating. So we at the grocery store with it. And I'm gonna see y'all in a minute. Store, quick update. Back from the grocery store, put all the groceries up. I went to the hair store, had to pick up some stuff for my uh, for my natural hair. And some stuff for my, um, my wig. So, boop, I dropped it, but I'll show y'all what I get. So, this is what this is the elixir. This is the this is the code to getting long, thick hair. But I stopped using it. Really add this to my deep conditioner. Kind of let it sit in my hair for like 10, 20 minutes, however long. Um, so this is for my natural hair. So I'm about to wash it and twist it down. Um, then I got this for my Amazon wig. Mariah told me to get this stuff. And I got some more, uh, I don't even know what these call razors, to do my eyebrows. I shape them up. My girl moved to Akron and I just can't see myself driving there. And I don't have that much eyebrow anyway, so hell, I can do it myself. Then I found this cute little headband. Y'all know how I be at the hair store. They got little cute fake shit, but I love Louis. It's cute, so. Cute little headband to go on my wig. I'll show y'all what my wig looks like at some point. Then I got this mousse. This isn't what Mariah told me to get originally, but I had to FaceTime her. Like, girl, they don't got what you wanted because she wanted me to get the mousse that was um, Soft Sheen Carson, which is this brand. But they didn't have it in that particular store. But first things first, I have a bad headache. Um, I'm about to wash my hair in the bathtub because I already showered. I did my skincare and all of that. And I'm not gonna be showering again until tonight. And I had to go to the grocery store, so I'm not about to hop back in the shower just to wash my hair. But I also, I could do it in the kitchen. Maybe I'll do it in the kitchen. Oh. Okay, friends. The hair is clean. I'm about to deep condition it. I got lazy. It was either me or mama. So, her hair is like done, as y'all can see. If you don't see, that means you don't follow me on Instagram. So, do that. 
the link and stuff is in the bio. I'm gonna be across the screen. But anywho, see if I can set y'all up real cute like. All right, mama has been asleep. She's been napping for a while. But anyway, this is how I do my hair. Or decondition it. So, ain't it so cute? I got this little towel from Marshalls. Marshalls or TJ Maxx? One of the TJ Maxx gotta be. So, ooh. So this is what my hair looks like. Now, this is how it looks like, or this is what it looks like when we first get out. I really don't like my curl pattern because it just don't be. <sighs> but y'all know, we gotta make it do to do. Okay, so. I'm gonna get my clips. Oh, it's only two in here. Oh no. I need at least three. Alright, so for my. Ugh, and that shit stink. See, I usually get something with a little. Mm. But, I showed y'all this. I'm gonna use this. Castor oil. Aussie Moist. This is the other. Elixir. And some water. four sections and start in the back which is what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna have to finesse so my hair is clipped back I got my back portion spray it with some water but anyway I'm not about to give y'all walk through that could be a separate video but y'all this week has been trash I mean, it's been cool. Y'all just know that week before your period. It just be like, wet as fuck. Like my period, my actual period, don't even be that bad. But the week leading up, it's just trash, trash all around with me. But it take a lot, a lot, a lot. Just for one section, I know. sanitized all my shit not that much but do you and I pour my Jamaican black hair oil and you just throw that shit in your head I don't have a cute hair routine I just make it do what it do and I finger detangle my hair I rarely ever put a comb on my head unless it's straight because I'm trying to grow it back, okay? I can't just be snatching my head. I'm trying to get back to how I used to do my hair, how often, and my whole hair routine. I'm trying to get back to that. So, I didn't wash my hair in the shower before. So, I'm going back to my roots, standing myself in a bathroom mirror, putting hella product in my hair. My hair just soaks it all up. And I'm a product junkie, I can't help it. If I don't see it, it ain't in there, so. Which isn't always a good thing. But twist my hair to the back. Hopefully I can get through all of that before mama wake up. But we'll see. Cause me doing my hair takes a while. Cause I like to make sure it's completely detangled. Which I'll see. The lighting might not be all that great, but this is my hair. Which in reality, it doesn't look bad, but you know how your hair just feel bad? I don't like when my hair feel bad. It's just, mm -mm. I don't like it. 
foot. I think this section is completely detangled. I can bring my fingers straight through from all angles. And then, because I'm OCD like that, and I just want my hair to grow back, and be just how it was. I put a little more Jamaican black castor oil over it. And I just take it. I'm gonna get some product over there. Ain't no shower curtain. Can y'all see that? That's how you know I use a lot. Maybe I could just keep it in a ball like that. in my hair I just filed off the clear layer of my nails so that I can soak off this gel and I'm gonna do my nails um, and yeah Emory is still asleep and so I'm happy about that so I'm about to chill out I think I'm gonna watch Bridgerton I'm gonna finish I think I'm on like episode seven out of eight episodes I think so I'm about to finish watching that. Um, soak off my nails and these two little nail stumper thingies I got from Sally's some years ago. Drink my tea and treat and my acetone that I got from Walgreens. And that's what I use to soak off my nails. It shouldn't take long because I do this for my acrylic. So just gel nails on my natural nails shouldn't take long at all. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna soak my nails off right now and paint them later like when mama goes down to sleep because then i'd be then already twisted my hair down um i don't know i feel like i would mess up my nails if i did my nails like painted them and then went and twisted my hair probably not but that's just me that's what i'm gonna do probably Just soaked off. I haven't buffed them or anything. Burrow made us some shrimps and some what is these called? Garlic knots. They cook to perfection. Have a nice little crunch. Look at that. Mm. He's enjoying his. <laughs> I'm watching Lexi V on YouTube. But yeah, just checking in. I'm about to eat my little shrimp set. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I still do have on my shower cap. I'm about to, um, what am I about to do? I'm about to wash this deep conditioner out. I did, well, I was able to bust out my nails. If it'll focus. I was able to bust out my nails a little. 
I don't know why my camera acting down. Okay, there we go. Buffed them out. Whatever. Buff my nails out, okay? Okay. So I'm gonna finish my manicure either probably tonight when I do my feet and my face mask and stuff. And I'm trying to get through my hair because that's what's gonna take me. <sighs> and that's what's gonna take me the longest. And mama is still asleep. It's been two and a half hours, y'all. God is so good. God is so good. You see that? I got my cross on. So, let's get ready to wash this deep conditioner out while mama is asleep. I'm just taking out the ponytails I had. My hair is feeling okay. Not as good as it used to. That's okay. Can't expect the same results in one go at it, but I will. Pay more attention to my hair, like it just be shit. It could be postpartum still, but I definitely still need to do my part regardless. So this is it after being wrapped up. I would say honestly, it's been like an hour and a half. It's going on four right now. And we're feeling good. Well, look at that, see? See that? It's coming out. <clears throat> I gotta do way better. I need to take so much better care of my hair. But I can't put myself in the back seat anymore. I still has the conditioner, which is the Aussie Moist and the Jamaican Black Cast Oil. This is what it looks like so far. And I'm about to go wash it out. Now, if my hair just hung like this naturally, that'd be great. But shrinkage, as y'all seen, it's a motherfucker. So, it's not going to work for me. I'm about to go wash this out. And then, I'm going to see y'all when I get ready to twist my hair. There it is. Leave-in conditioner. Just in case y'all wasn't able to see. Cold sculpting custard. And I have... The curl smoothie, got a few little scrunchies, my water bottle, comb, I'm just about to twist my hair up. And then also okay y'all, it is like, is fire, but my phone is too far away, but it's like nine-ish. I'm about to do my skincare routine, which will consist of a mask. Um, A mask and a scrub for my lips. Um, so yeah. And then I have a package to unbox with y'all. And I may or may not do my nails. I don't know how I'm feeling tonight. I already have my bonnet on when I had some wine, so I'm kinda sleepy. But I wanna cram everything into like being done tomorrow. So, I'm gonna start with this CMOS cleanser. My face. And then I'm gonna do a mask. And then, yeah. Face is clean. Next step. Is his face mask. Now I do gotta put my glasses back on. I know I'm blind, but I'm gonna try to use this CMOS mask, which is this. I don't know why nothing is focusing today. This. I don't need when it comes to this little bottle. Sponge, I guess. Oh, I think this is for if you use like making a mask. Has this container. Measuring cups. things here a brush and a something these two 
rubber things. What the heck kind of... I don't know what a teaspoon is. Is this a teaspoon? I don't know what that means. It's a 2.5. This one say 5 and this one say 15. Well, we're just gonna eyeball it. Okay. Just gonna take like a teaspoon of y'all. I don't know. But we just gonna I'm gonna give it a little more. A little more because I don't know. to mix it with I'm just gonna mix it with the brush I feel like why not let's just do it let's just get to it and see what we need here this is what we have so far I may need some more but I'm not trying to put like a thick 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 layer on it so This is actually, I think, my first time doing a clay mask. So, luck, wish me. This ain't even. Is that not enough? Like, is that? Take it right, man. Just like water. I don't know. So I know. I guess it's working out. This is what we have. This is what we have right now. So it says, Oh Lord, I ain't gonna make an answer, Jesus. You'll feel your face pull, say, Okay, so I'll leave it on until it's dry. So. Y'all, this shit is burning. Not burning, I guess it said pulsate, so it's probably what it's doing, but. Mm -mm. I don't like that. But, I mean. I suppose it's doing what it needs to do, so. No. But it's drying rather quickly. But let me go ahead and open this package. I couldn't find good lighting, so bear with me. I got a package from Target. I already know what it is. It's this, um, and if I'm talking like tight lipped, it's because this mask, you know, snatching me real quick. So, it's this sponsored post that I have to do with the company called Ray. Um, I got the immunity drops. For my sponsor post. I hope it's focusing y'all. I can't see. I ain't got my glasses on, but I think it is. Cute packaging. I like the lime green. Highlighter yellow, whatever. Post on Instagram with my experience uh, for this sponsor post. This is what it looks like. You'll see a picture of it on my Instagram or boomerang. I don't know what type of content I want to do, but this is that and if y'all see like little streaks my fan is on I don't know if y'all can see what I see what it looks like heat waves or something but this is what I got so I'm about to wash this mask off because it's actually low-key annoying the hell out of me I cannot cap so I'm about to wash this off it's definitely dry my lips are like not moving all right so this is my skin directly after the mask 
So yeah, looking good, feeling great. It did like tingle and like pulsate-ish, like it said, so that's true. Now, to put some hydration back in, I'm gonna use my toner. because my battery gonna go dead but I'm just gonna go in with this sea moss oil here I like to do it on my face it's still a little damp oh this is like so soothing skincare super simple I don't really have problematic skin so yeah my camera's about to go dead so I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow I'm not gonna do my nails tonight just because the camera's about to go dead and I want to film a little bit of it so I'm just gonna save my nails and my toes for tomorrow I will see y'all tomorrow and bye hello everyone we are back it is now Sunday so sorry that this video is taking like 50 11 days to complete but y'all know i'm a mom so i gotta do it in spurts so what do we do so far we washed my hair we did a face mask did my skincare now just have to do my nails and my toes which i will be recording next and we're going on a date tomorrow to the movies um to silver spot to see either fatal with michael ely or the Marksman, I think, with Liam Nesson, Neeson. I don't know how to say his name, but the man from Taken. We went to go watch the Browns game today. We lost, unfortunately, but excuse my boyfriend out there. He's playing the game. If you know, you know, whatever. So that's what we're doing right now. I am about to put some water in my little foot bath. My new foot bath I just got from Amazon the other day. I got my gel nail stuff all in here. Ordered that from Amazon too, so that'll be my first time trying out both of those things. And yeah, that's all I got. Okay, y'all. So I am currently soaking my feet. Excuse this whole mess here. Mm. I'm soaking my feet though it feels so good I have like the one with the little roller balls and like the little scrubby pads and all the cool little foot gadgets so soak my feet for a little while and then I'm gonna go in with this callus remover just like at the real nail salon because that's the whole point and I got one of these boys to use for my feet so i'm gonna do those real quick give myself a quick pedicure and i'm gonna use my gel nail thingy for the first time so i don't know i really don't know how to do gel nails but kiki told me how to do it so shouldn't be that hard and i watched her do my nails so i'm gonna do my feet and my toes i mean my feet my toes I'm do my feet and my hands and then from there we'll jump into tomorrow where i do my makeup put on my little wig cap apply my little amazon wig on my um meek millies and go for our date night to the movies and that'll be that so so my feet are done i'll show you those in a minute just checking in i'm about to do my nails and then i'm done y'all i'm tired it is 11 28 you girl is tired so I'll show you my nails and my toes tomorrow morning but I am gonna do them tonight I'm just not gonna get back on camera tonight so I'll see y'all tomorrow
super well this is it's like a pinkish color I don't know if the lighting is like too bright because I got my ring light right here so I can see better I don't know what's wrong with my light my bedroom the ceiling light it's like super dim but these are my nails my toes are kind of trash but I'll show y'all anyway just because fuck it these are my toes got my sea moss butter on there these are my little fat toes. Fat toes. What is going on, folks? Today is Monday, January 18th. Happy MLK Day, Black Lives Matter. All that, period. Now, today is the last day of our weekend and a day long self-care vlog. Um, what I'm about to do now is Touch up my little wispies, my eyebrows. I already showered, did my skincare. Um, if y'all hear Emmy crying, she's trying not to go to sleep for her nap, but she needs to because mommy and daddy are going to the movies and she at least needs one nap before she goes to her grandma's house. So, she just gonna have to work that out. Never put on a wig by myself. It's a headband wig, so I assume it wouldn't be that hard. Pray for me. Pray for us. Okay? I don't know what. I'm going to put some dang um, Jamaican black cast oil on my eyebrows. I always forget something. Alright. I'm also grab this spoolie to brush these boys out. See what I'm working with. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna work on my angles, y'all, because I know y'all can't see none of this. But in the event that y'all can, I'm gonna record it anyway. So what I do is literally just shape it up. It don't take nothing but five minutes because I already don't got no eyebrows. This just makes it easier for me to fill them in, which I do a decent job at. I ain't a professional at all, but I low key want to get like some. What do you call those? Is it henna? No. I don't know. Whatever people do when they get their eyebrows not threaded. When you get like some eyebrows, I guess I forget what it's called. Lamination. I really can't think of the time, but... Taped them up. Now I'm about to use my Anastasia. Hope I can find that. I 
my brow wigs and ebony. Let me hurry up y'all cause I would take, I don't really have a set way of doing my brows. I kind of just go with the flow. Because I can never do my eyebrows the same way twice in the pictures that I have taken. When my eyebrows are done, they never look the same compared to another picture. So, it depends on my luck. So, oh shoot, that almost fell. So, I got this much so far. That's how I make my outline. So I start on my right eye. I make the tail the darkest. And I just fill them in, y'all. Really? I don't do nothing. I can't even make this longer than what it is because I just don't do much. I just. I don't. There's not much to do for me. You draw them suckers on and clean them up with your concealer. And that's it. Focus, like what the fuck? Use my Fenty, Fenty Beauty, and then I use this brush that I used before to line them up. This brush to blend it out. I don't know what none of these brushes are. I'm not a makeup guru. I just use what works. <sighs> oh, this is why I wish I had a. Ooh. Maybe I got a little. I mean, okay, that works. And then we're just gonna blend this down. Y'all, I'm gonna have my, my angles together. But if I waited until they were actually together, I wouldn't start a YouTube. So you gotta make a do with a do, girl, or you will never get started. And I can talk myself out of some shit real quick. Dang, I'm so mad. I'm so mad, y'all. So now I'm about to do the other eyebrow and I'll be back when I put on my wig cap well y'all I tried see we are back at square one took everything off because I didn't have any eyebrow pencil and I tried to use y'all should have seen me I tried to use my eyeliner and obviously my eyeliner is black my eyebrow pencil is like dark brown. You can clearly tell the difference. So, I'm just gonna be fresh facing it. Which I don't mind, cause I like my skin. And makeup is less work. So, I'm just gonna skip to the next step. Just putting on my, um, what you call it, stocking cap. Doing these edges. And I'm gonna get my scarf. I do this either, so I don't know. I'm gonna put my stocking cap on. Slide it back. Well, there's that. I use the edge booster. It's the true stuff. I don't really have edges even. Up. No, wait. I have edges. I just don't have baby hair. Um, never have as far as I'm concerned. 
so I couldn't really follow that trend. And I'll be damned if I made some like these other grown women. It just ain't worth all of that. So I believe I don't know how far back this stuff. Should I have done my edges first? See, these are the things I don't know. Well, I'm gonna have to wash my face again. I see. I forgot I put concealer on. And so, ooh, baby hair. There's something I want. I'm okay with that. I'm sure if I was in dire need, plenty of females out here that know how to make them. So. I still don't know how far back this um, wig cap is supposed to be. And brush all of that back. Now that I think about it, I'm sure I didn't even have to go through all the work that I did as far as like, ooh, as far as like, Twisting all my hair up and blah 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 blah. Like, it's a headband wig, first of all. I don't think that's far back enough for my little headband wig. Like, I really can't go back too far. Because I went through all of that to twist my hair down. So, it is some type of part to the back. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Slick em, boy. Slick em. Slick them. I blame my mama. I probably could have had baby hair. But she relaxed the fuck out of my hair. My hair, my edges never broke off. I've never had, cause that's what I'm assuming women have. It's just broken off edges and you make it into it. Uh, baby hairs, which is cool. But now it's about a 10 at our big age. That's what that is. That's not baby hair. That's broken off edges. Boo. Here she is. She is from Amazon. I paid eighty-eight dollars, and if you so happen to like the look of this, once I put it on and get her together, I'll leave the link in my description box. But this is my first wig. Well, first headband wig to try. It's eighteen inches. I mean, I've already opened it. Obviously, the curls is cute. It's just that the edges. I mean, the ends are dry. This is what we got. Kind of nervous. So when I put this on my head, it's only going to sit like right here. Which may turn out to be cute. I'm just about to. And it comes with a little. Damn. Whew. Hey. That thing is going to thing. I'll tell you what. This is what I'll be into, y'all. Alright, let's try this again. So, they say... Pop it on. Just, woo! 
pepper on. Let's go to some different lighting. Oh Lord, it's hot. I gotta cut the fan on in this bizzo. Yeah, my face is shining, but it's cute. It's actually very cute. Let's go see all around things. Well, that's really good on you, sweetie. What do you think? You look beautiful. I didn't expect it to do to be this okay looking. You look super natural, right? Like I just have a headband on? You look beautiful, babe. Thanks. I'll be looking like this with my glasses on. But I got pretty skin, so. <laughs> it works. At least I ain't no crater face to ass beat. No, I'm playing. <laughs> <laughs> super cute. 